Hello friends, welcome back to lmsdaily.com. In today's video, we will learn how you can reset the password of users in bulk in Moodle through the CSV file. We have already learned about how you can upload new users in Moodle by using the CSV file. And now in this lesson, we will learn how you can update the password for their user accounts through the same CSV file. In order to do that, you need to first create a CSV file of the users uh, on your site for whom you would like to update the password. You can either create the CSV file manually or let me show you another way to do that. So you can go to site admin and then go to the users tab. And here you can click on this bulk users actions. So here this page has two options. First one is to choose the different filters, either based on username or uh, the different filters, which you can see here. Or otherwise, you can see all the users who are there in the list here. And as of now, I have only 13 users on this site. So you might see a longer list here if you have multiple users on your Moodle site. So here you can select the users for whom you would like to change the password. So let me say that out of these 13 users, I would like to change the passwords for all these 10 users so you can select them by clicking the control button on your uh, keyboard and uh, then click on add to selection so that they will be added in this right pin so now you can see that we have selected all uh, 10 out of 13 and then after selection you can expand this with the selected users so here first we will be downloading this users as the list and on the next page, you can choose which file format. So I will suggest to keep it to CSV file format only. And then you can see that we have downloaded this file. So let me open this file. Okay. So this is the file which we have just downloaded. Here you can see the user ID, username, email, first name, last name, ID number, institution, department, phone one, phone two, city, country, etc. Out. Uh, based on the populated fields from these users profile. So here let us add one more column with the name password and here I will be just giving a default password for all of them and I'm just copying this for all the users and that's it just click save changes for this file and now we can close this file. Now we have prepared the CVC file with our new password. So let us go back to this users tab again and go to upload users. Here you need to drop the file which we have just updated. Uh, so let me just check this file and drop it here and then click on upload users button. So here you can see that all the fields which we have just seen in the CSV file are listed down here and on this status column you can see that it is a duplicate address which means that the user account for all these uh, users is already created in Moodle. So accordingly you have to change these upload uh, settings here. So instead of add new only skip existing users you need to go to update existing users only because all these users are already having an account in Moodle. Now for the existing users de details, you can choose to override with file and defaults. And then you can see this new field coming up existing user password. So here we can see and change it to update. So now it will get the new password from this file, which is default mentioned here. And then just uh, after this, you can click on upload users button here. And you can see the progress on the bottom, which says that users updated 10 and then users having a weak password zero errors zero. So now it means that we have updated the password for all these 10 users. So just click continue and that's it. So this is how you can update the password for your users in Moodle by using the CSV file upload method. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any questions about this process, please feel free to send them in the comments section below and I will be happy to help you out with them. Have a great day. Thank you.